Yeah, it's scary stuff. Millions could be tuning into what you're doing every day. You would have no way of knowing who's watching you. There's some of your most intimate and personal moments taking place in the privacy of your own home, or so you may think. They're being watched. Every move made from watching TV, eating dinner, picking up the baby, changing clothes, or wearing none at all, you may be under surveillance. You had a white shirt on the other day. I've been watching you. Really? Yes. CBS2 found it easy to peer in on thousands of compromised security cameras from around the country. The live streamed video broadcasts children from inside their daycare, classroom, people and pets in their home, at work, even in their place of worship. The security Whoa. camera, mm -hmm. right, mm -hmm. that is meant to protect you guys is actually broadcasting your image out. This woman was shocked when we explained how we stumbled upon her employer's security camera online. It's so creepy. Not only allowing us to watch her, but actually oh. track her exact location in Midtown. When you did research, where did you find this IP address was registered? This is a domain name uh, provider from Russia. Ian Culleton with the coding school Hack Reactor says it's a Russian website collecting this live footage, posting it online, where people not only watch it, they even comment on it. We asked retired NYPD detective Joe Jackalone, what's the motivation? Well, believe it or not, people pay money for this stuff, especially if they get a video clip of people, let's say, uh, doing things that you would normally do in your own privacy, your own home. Or it could be used by criminals to case a location like this Upper East Side townhouse. They can actually find out when people come and go, they leave the house, make an opportunity to uh, burglarize it. Because the live feed pinpoints an address within a block that everyone can see and isn't difficult to find. The bush and everything would be a dead giveaway. And you may be responsible for it all. Password protected Wi Fi is not enough. Each brand of camera arrives with the same default settings, and it's up to you to change them. Not changing your default username and password is a little bit like uh, hiding your key under the mat. You're still locking your door, but it's the first place a potential home invader is going to look. That simple update, then we're going to have to create a password. We'll protect your privacy. Thank you. You're welcome. From prying eyes. Head to our website, cbsnewyork.com, for the steps to create multiple layers of security, making it difficult for a camera to be compromised.